such a hot street. I want to see those dice. I think they're crooked. Uh, shut up, Pink. They're our dice. <laughs> I want to meet with the material officer tomorrow. I want to go over the supplies for next month. What time would you like the meeting to be, sir? Come on. Seven. Seven, yes, sir. <laughs> sir. Don't you think that's a little late to be? Four. Point is four. Oh, very good, sir. Four is a lot better. You see, if you keep Will the you men... Shut up, you dunce. Four. Four. Ah, yeah. you go. Nice All right, you men in there. Freeze. You're all under arrest. That's a lot. I want you to get names and ranks and serial numbers. Names? I said you men come out there with your hands up. This is your captain speaking. Well, little Christina needs a tonsil operation right away. My wife says it's gonna cost 300 bucks. For a tonsil operation? Three, 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 three. She wants me to wire the money right away. Oh, brother, what timing? Just when we're all flat broke. Hey, any of you guys score on the mail call? Nothing uh, here, T. How about you, Mr. Parker? You huh? get something we can hock? Oh, I don't know, it's for Mom. Maybe it's another batch of a jellied spinach. Jeez. <laughs> It's a number painting Six set. Great masterpieces by Paul Gauguin, world famous French artist. Hey, boy. Mom always said I was artistic ever since I started a finger pin on the wall with my oatmeal. Uh, we'd have more luck hustling the jelly spinach. <laughs> all right, you boys. Here's the duty list for today. Uh, now then, we already got the duty list for today, Skip. We got to raise 300 bucks right away. What? Yeah, little Christina needs a tonsil operation. Oh, what a rough break. Now, where in the heck can we find 300 bucks in a hurry? Maybe I write and ask Admiral Yamamoto for buck pay. <laughs> Speaking of Yamamoto, ha, what's so wrong with you and me going over and asking Binghamton now for an advance in our pay? Hey, maybe you're right. The worst he can do is fire us, and then we can let you have our unemployment insurance. <laughs> We're wasting time. Let's go. Good luck. They don't stand a chance of getting that dough from yeah. Lead Bottom. If only we had something to sell. Some hot item that, uh... Wait a minute. Didn't Gorgon live right here in the South Pacific? Yeah, so what? So what if we suddenly discovered some genuine masterpieces by the great Paul Gauguin? <laughs> Boy, I bet they'd sell like crepe Suzettes. Huh? That's French hotcakes to you, Willie. That's a famous painting. Looks more like somebody's algebra homework. Sure, <laughs> sure. Once you put the right numbered paints in the right numbered spaces, behold, instant masterpiece. Hey! <laughs> Well, excuse me, sir. I, oh, speak of the devil. Awfully oh. glad to see you, Mikhail. <laughs> now, hear this, and this is an order. You're restricted to your base until further notice. <laughs> restricted? What for? What'd we do? Yeah, you usually hate us for some reason. Oh, I'll tell you what for. Senator Duncan is in the area. And we hear he's a real blue nose. Oh, that's a shame. I always hate to see a senator who drinks. <laughs> you hate to see us? Get out of here. Get out of here. Uh, no, 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 wait a minute, sir. Wait, uh, before we go, uh, I'd like to ask a favor of you, sir. Oh, was it a favor? Uh, just a small one. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, I was wondering if you'd authorize an advance in our next month's pay, sir. <clears throat> Mikhail, if I authorize anything, it's going to be your execution. Get out of here. Uh, no, 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 wait a minute, sir. You see, Quartermaster Christopher's little girl that needs a tonsil operation, and, and it costs 300 bucks, sir. Yeah, sure, of course, of course. You know something, Mikhail? I'm just slipping. You used to be able to tear my heart out with a lot better stories than some poor little child who needs a miserable tonsillectomy. Put yourself in her place. How'd you like to go through the rest of the war with a sore throat and a runny nose? <laughs> all, right, all right, all right, all right. We're going, Captain. But thanks a lot, sir. For having such a good heart. You act more like a guy with a bad liver. You <laughs> dodo. Get out of my yard. <laughs> liver. Oh, child hater. Get out of here. Oh, 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 oh,
Beautiful food. It's beautiful. Look, an already signed and everything. Well, old Gogon couldn't have done better himself. A couple more like this and Christina's tonsils are as good as out. We could have enough dough left over to even take out her appendix. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 Skip, any luck with old Leadbottom? Yeah, I'm afraid not, Christy, but don't worry. We'll... Hey, what's this? Genuine Gorgon Mester. <laughs> All right, now what in the blazes is going on here? Hey, that's one of my number paintings. Number paintings? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Got to find out why they needed that money. But, sir, don't you think oh, that... Oh, shut you... up, shut up. I know we're going to catch him with something big this time. I feel it in my bones. I hope so, sir. The last time you said that, it turned out to be your rheumatism. I... <laughs> For crying out loud. Wait, right, wait a minute, Skip. No one is ever going to get the wiser. We just cover up the numbers. Oh, just kidding. Oh, that's just dandy. And do you know what'll happen if Binghamton finds out about this little racket? Huh? He's going to cover us with numbers right across our chests. <laughs> now, Roy, they're in the numbers racket. Come on, we got him. <laughs> Shut up and dance. I'm quick before they get away. Oh, gee, come on. Get in here. All right, you racketeers, you face. Oh, hi, Captain. Uh, what's all the excitement, sir? Boy, you must have got dressed in a rush. <laughs> Your underwear showing. <laughs> Just keep away from me, you boo. That's all I want from you is keep away from me. All right, McHale, what are you trying to hide there? What is that? Blah, 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 blah. Uh, nothing, nothing, sir. Nothing of what you, you see. We're just uh, uh, trying to give a little homey touch around here, sir. It does brighten things up, don't you think? Uh, oh, sir, Captain Binghamton, look at this. Get, give me that. Art auction today, genuine Gauguin masterpieces. A little homey touch, huh? And there's the name right down in the corner. Gauguin. Oh, now, well, now wait a minute, sir. You see? Da, 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 da. So that's why you wanted the $300, huh? You found some priceless Gauguin masterpieces and you're buying them up dirt cheap from the poor, ignorant natives and you're selling them at a fat profit, right? <laughs> well, not exactly, sir. You see the... Oh, no, 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 Quint, Quint, Quint. Don't, don't apologize, don't apologize. I'm, I'm surprised. I didn't know your water rats had this much culture. <laughs> oh. Well, thank you, sir. But you see... No, no, the... no, Michael. I want to encourage you. And just to prove my point, I'm going to buy that picture from you for uh, $300. Now, wait a minute, sir. You see, uh, uh, look, Skip. We all know that's pretty cheap for an original Gauguin. But he is the captain. Now, honest, Captain, you don't want to buy this painting for $300. I bought this painting already. It is mine, mine, mine. Oh, sir, you're bleeding. I am? Uh, yes. No, I am not bleeding. But they're going to be. That painting is still wet. I've been swindled. You're under arrest, you art hustlers. Well, it's not our fault, sir. We didn't have time to put up the wet paint sign. <laughs> right, sir. I've been trying to tell you that... Now, you knock it off, Mikhail. Gauguin is dead and this painting has just been finished. Now, how do you explain that? I've caught you red-handed. Uh, correction, sir. I'd say it's more of a purple. You see, red has... Oh, a... shut <laughs> up. I'm going to call it SP. <laughs> how about now, Captain? Skip, we've really had it now. You can say that again. Oh, brother. Hey, a brother right now would make all the difference. What do you mean, Skip? Shh. You guys follow my lead. Oh, a captain. Uh... Now, you just save your breath, Mikhail. That is the most dastardly trick you've ever pulled on me, trying to palm off that forgery as a genuine Paul Gauguin. Now, I agree, Captain. Uh, we should have told you right off the bat that that isn't a Paul Gauguin. Oh, no, 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 no. Belay that. Trying to cop a guilty plea isn't going to help you now, Mikhail. <laughs> what I mean is, sir, that uh, that painting is by Paul Gauguin's uh, kid brother, uh, Claude Gauguin. <laughs> Are you trying to tell me that Paul Gauguin has a brother by the name of Claude Gauguin? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, you see, uh, uh, Claude is still in seclusion, uh, painting over at uh, Colony Island. Oh, we saw him yesterday, uh, uh, just by accident, when we were out on patrol. And he kind of took a liking to us. So he gave us a painting. The kid does have his brother's touch, doesn't he? Well, uh, you mean the kid... That's right, sir, that we did not swindle you after all. You are now looking at a genuine Gauguin painting. I have Claude Gauguin. And we'll still let you have it at the original low, low price. <laughs> we'll get the money when I meet this Claude Gauguin. 
Uh, when you meet him, sir, but... That's but... right, Mikhail. Now, you will meet me one hour over at Mainside, and we'll pay a little visit to this Kalani Island, and Claude Gauguin better be there painting his little heart out, because if he isn't, you and your bunco artists are going to be sitting for a group portrait at Portsmouth Prison. Have a Well, now we've really got our foot into it. In one hour, we've got to come up with a French painter who doesn't even exist. Oi, vey! What? Oi, vey! Here we are, Captain. Now, I, I feel I'd better warn you, sir. You see, Monsieur Gauguin is a very eccentric artist. So I feel we'd better get in and out real fast, huh? No, no, no. That is not right to move. See what I mean, sir? Let us see. Monsieur Gauguin? Uh, uh, no, 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 no. I do not like it. It is not right. Uh, you, you need a haircut. Uh, here, do something with the arm. That's better. Now, you, with, uh, <clears throat> oh, uh, everybody looks this way. Ah, uh, good. <laughs> <clears throat> now, that look better. Okay, back. Good, hold it. Ah, uh, now, that is better. Monsieur Gauguin? Ah, uh, no! I just get in the mood and you... Mon ami! Ah, uh, oh, ah. Uh, Mademoiselle, lunch. Ah, mon ami! Monsieur Goubert! Hey, I dare him. He's not even introduced to me. What is it? Oh, well, well sir, please, Monsieur Gauguin, this is our friend. <laughs> oh, I have no time to meet the friends. The people at the Louvre keep pestering me. Hurry, hurry, hurry. They don't want it good. They want it by Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, sir, uh, your work is in the Louvre? Uh, where did you think it was? In the fish market? Who is this stupid nitwit? Oh, it's, this is our captain, Captain Binghamton. <laughs> Who's about to buy one of your paintings for $300. Well, make no matter. It's 300 for the... Uh, uh, <clears throat> the... Oh, well, this is good. <laughs> huh? First date. Ah, this is wonderful. I must write my good friend Toulouse Lautrec and tell him of the good news. Oh, Monsieur Toulouse Lautrec has been dead for over forty years. Is uh, <clears throat> well, that's probably why he does not answer my letters. Uh, ah. <laughs> poor shorty. <laughs> Back to the drawing board. I must begin my masterpiece. Oh, ah. masterpiece. Uh. See ya. No faking. Oh, uh, uh, sorry, sir. Sorry. Uh, uh, come right this way, sir. Uh, I told you it was a bit daffy, sir. I think we'd better go. Yes. Uh, yes. But first, uh, how about the three hundred dollars for the uh, painting? Uh, I'm his agent oh, on these deals. All right, the three hundred dollars. I might have known you'd be the agent. <laughs> Thank you, sir. You've got yourself a great bargain, yeah. sir. Sir, what I just thought that? of an even greater bargain. Oh. Just imagine having your portrait painted by the great Gauguin. Oh, that would be carpenter. That's the most ridiculous thing I ever heard of. Oh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. Yes, sir. You keep out of this, Mikhail. This boy has one good idea a year, and you try to inhibit him. That's a wonderful idea, Elroy. Just think Thank of it. You. An original Binghamton by Gauguin. But, Captain... Uh, sir. Uh, monsieur. Uh, pardon me, monsieur. I hate to bother you again, but I was wondering, monsieur, I, I, do you ever do... Uh, Portraits. No, 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 no. The master does not do portraits, sir. Either he does my portrait or there's no deal. Oh, well, he'll do your portraits. Now, wait a minute, Goober. Captain, look, you can't go around posing for paintings. You know, supposing uh, Senator Duncan uh, showed up on Taratupa. Oh, Senator Duncan. Yes, sir. That's right, Mikhail. All right, then we'll have to take him with us. Who? Him. <laughs> the Taratupa? Yes, Mikhail. Either he does my portrait in my office or there's no deal. Mm. Au revoir, monsieur. <laughs> Yeah, what I tell you, Skip. Hey. How you like, Skipper? -san? We put out new number painting. Quick as one, two, three. Oh, that's <laughs> fine, Fuji, fine. Uh, but right now we got a special rush order for you. You gotta whip out a portrait of Binghamton and fast. Yeah, or we'll be in a break quick as one, two, three. <laughs> okay, I get right to work. Okay. Hey! Where are the numbers? Sorry, Fuji. This one's gonna have to be strictly ad lib. Yeah, here's a picture of Lead Bottom to go by. Yeah. Good thing I missed lunch. Okay. I try. Okay, Fuji, go ahead, go ahead. 
Boys, now all we got to do is to pray that Chuck can stall off Binghamton till he finishes. Hmm. Huh? Oh, uh, <clears throat> Captain, I'm at the mouth. Could you smile? Huh? <laughs> ah, good teeth. Yes. Now, now, now for the easy part, we just... Uh, oh, no. Oh, oh, no. <clears throat> Cut! I cannot go on. Oh, I have lost the mood. We have to start all over. <laughs> oh, just a minute, Mr. Sir. With all due respect, this is the eighth time you've changed the pose. <clears throat> Silence! Better Jacques and Dormez-vous! Huh? <laughs> uh, I am the artist. I will pick the pose. Sacre green. Oh, you mean sacre blue, don't you, monsieur? Uh, blue. A green! Oh. I am the artist. Green. I will pick green. the color. <laughs> now, wait. I have it. All sing together. Uh, good. Now, I have it. I will pick the pose. I have it. We will paint Binghamton as the hero. Oh, good. Yes. Binghamton, the conqueror. Yes, yes, yes. Binghamton on the back of a horse. Yes, 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 oh, but we yes, don't yes, have a horse, yes. sir. You don't have a horse? No, sir. Well, I quit. I am an artist. I do oh, not no, have to no, quit. No, no, wait, no, wait a minute, sir. I... <laughs> Just a minute, mister. Just a minute. Uh, fee, fee. I've got an idea, Elroy. Get sir. down on the floor. Get down oh, but on the floor. Sir, I, I, that's an order. Get down there. Now, now Claude, how's this? Huh? Huh? Wait a minute. Here. Oh. Oh. What do you think? Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Good. Has a good build for it, yes? yes. <laughs> Get down. Uh, see? Well, good. See, the line important. Like I tell you. All right. <laughs> Good boy. But, sir, I don't think it's fair of you to do Shut this up, to me. Shut Roy, or you won't get your lump of sugar. <laughs> uh, could the horse lift the front leg? Good. <laughs> That's supposed to be Binghamton? I thought you said he was a whiz. Not the rooker I read about them? Are you kidding? Even Frankenstein would consider that an insult. <laughs> I guess I'm not so good without numbers. Binghamton will never pay us for that mess. It sure doesn't look like a go gap. Well, Skip, what are we gonna do? I've got to send my wife that money. I know it, Christy, I know it. If only Binghamton wasn't so bugged and having his portrait painted. We could have faked something or other, anything. It... Hey, wait a minute. For well, sure, that's it. What's it, Skip? If it's a Gauguin portrait he wants, then it's a Gauguin portrait he'll get. Could <laughs> <laughs> you kind of hurry it up a little bit, Monsieur? I'm getting tired of smiling. I'm getting a little tired myself, sir. What are you tired about? Horses don't have to smile. Sector <laughs> Pink, you have broken the master's concentration. How dare you? Horse, back to the stable. Oh, 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 oh sorry, sir. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. Carpenter, you clap so that he's not gonna wear spurs. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I tell you, I'm very sorry about this, mister, but uh, in a war like this, they'll draft anybody. <laughs> well, uh, c'est la vie, and no matter. Uh, but don't worry, I have completed the most difficult part of the portrait. Oh, you have? Well, I... <laughs> well, all you did was sign your name. What's so difficult about that? Uh -huh. Have you ever tried to spell Gauguin? Look, two G's. Ever tried to make a G? Make a G. See how hard it is. Look. Well, you're just playing a little tail. Oh, for heaven's sake. All those hours posing. You French flea brain. French flea brain? You have insulted the master. <clears throat> you know what this means? Fifi? On guard! On guard. Now, wait a minute. 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 I love your signature. I love it. Claude, your signature, Claude. You don't. I could say that I like it. Hold, 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 hold it, Claude. Hold it. Hold it. Settle down, Captain. Do shit. Oh. Settle down. I have just spent hours and hours in here posing. And look at this thing. Look at this. I wouldn't pay three cents for that, let alone $300. Hmm. Huh. Well, have you ever tried to make a G? Oh, for goodness <laughs> sakes. Well, no, 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 easy does it, Captain, easy. Now, no, no, no. With, the, with the master's permission, I, 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 I believe I have the solution. Hey, come on, come with me. <laughs> Wait here. <laughs> hey, what are these girls doing here? What's with these girls? Why, 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 why? Oh, well, well, it's all very simple, sir. You see, Monsieur Gauguin can't work without familiar surroundings. So we brought them here. Now you can work, eh, master? Yes, I am inspired. Uh, C.C. Si, si. uh, I mean, wee oui, wee. Oui. Uh, what is this? Skip, I don't get it either. I can't paint one face, let alone this crowd. No, I don't. 
worry. Don't worry. Uh, easy does it, Captain. Oh, easy yes, does it, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> there we are. A little flour right here, sir. And just sit right oh, down here and make yourself Wait a comfortable. Minute. I don't need this. There's no reason for me to do this kind of thing. I just... But how are you, my dear? <laughs> well, there. Now you can paint. <laughs> I have a fresh canvas for you. Uh, uh, there. That should inspire you, eh? <laughs> ah, yes, yes. Now, this is what I call a piece of canvas. Uh, this shall be my greatest work yet. <clears throat> uh, Captain, say cheese. Uh, uh, Lieutenant, where can I find Captain Bingham? Well, the last time I saw him, oh, Senator Duncan. Oh, we were expecting you, sir, but not without a little warning. Oh, come, come, Lieutenant. The only way to uncover high living is to drop in without warning, right? Oh, right. Take me to Captain Binghamton. And for his sake, he'd better have his nose to the grindstone. Well, you can count on that, Senator. One thing about the Captain, he is all business. Oh, all business. <laughs> Straight ahead. Ha! Say, Finney. Ha! Claude Gauguin, you have done it again. Oh, did you finish so fast? <laughs> Excuse me, lady. Oh, let me help you, Captain. Oh, yes, sir. With the right atmosphere, why, he goes like a house of fire. Oh, I <laughs> see it, yes. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, where am I? Uh, <clears throat> don't cough. Here's the one with the glasses. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. I Oh, that's wonderful resemblance. Wonderful. Well, we promised you a Gauguin portrait, and we delivered, sir. Now it's your turn. My oh, yes. <laughs> oh, it's this business of being a genius is hot work. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Captain, uh, you better go back to your quarters now and uh, get out of your sarong, sir. No, 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 I want to look at some more. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? No. Uh, no, 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 mon ami. Let the peasant talk. After all, he has a genuine Gauguin to hang on his wall. <laughs> I have a genuine parker to hang on my yard arm. It's outrageous. Hey, yeah, well, Captain, I can explain. You explain it at the court martial. You've done it to me again, haven't you? <laughs> you swindlers are under arrest. Oh, boy, and, and an aura of war. Captain, 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 well, hi, I'm Captain Binghamton. Uh, You're Captain Binghamton? Uh, well, now, Senator, I think I can explain. I can... Save it for the court-martial. In my entire career, I've never seen anything as disgraceful as this. Even in Washington. Me neither. Au revoir. Now, wait a minute, you clod go on you. Uh, uh, Senator, these men are responsible for everything you see here. Excuse me. Did uh, he call you Claude Gauguin? Uh, yes, he did. <clears throat> That's the nicest thing he has called me in the last hour. And are you by any chance related to Paul Gauguin, the famous French artist? <clears throat> now, wait a minute, Senator. He's no more related to Paul Gauguin than I am. Uh, now, 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 Captain. Captain, there's no sense in going on with our secret any longer, especially with such a cultured man like the Senator. Why, uh, all he's got to do, sir, is to look at this painting and know that it was done by Paul Gauguin's brother. Yes, it does have the Gauguin style. Oh, of course, sir. And that's the, You see, the captain was posing for the painting in a typical Gauguin setting. Uh, right, Captain? Uh, yes, yes, I see. Oh, and there you are, Captain. Oh, yeah, with the glasses. <laughs> well, I, I, I must apologize for flying off the handle. Congratulations. You're a lucky man, Captain. Uh, Monsieur Gauguin, do you think, well, uh, would you ever consider painting me? Uh, no, 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 that's, uh, that's not possible, Senator. No, you see, uh, the, the master here is uh, very, very busy. Lots of orders from Paris and all that. Uh, uh, no, 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 mon ami. It would be a pleasure, uh, providing, of course, the price is right. <laughs> hey, come, let us discuss this in private. Oh. Imagine me meeting Paul Gauguin's brother. Imagine, oh, uh, just a moment. <clears throat> Goodbye, uh, peasant. <laughs> now, I think I do <laughs> <laughs> so thanks to the boys from the bottom of my heart, and a very special thanks to Monsieur Claude Gauguin. Uh, it was nothing, Monsieur. It's just this little simple American know-how. <laughs> Poof. Yeah, yeah, but you can sure thank your lucky stars that the senator was called back to Washington before you had to paint him. Wow, <laughs> that's the truth. You can say that again. I don't care if I never see another painting as long as I live. You know it. Hey, where's Fooch with that bowl of fruit we ordered? You're right. Hey, Fooch, where's that fruit? I'm coming. Voila! En direct, ce qui passe en. C'est très bien, n'est-ce pas? Get out of here!